Could have been all I saved in two years of farm work. All for Lori. Here it is. $42.31. Anybody want to buy a gun? <laughs> hey, Joe. Bought a brand new last Thanksgiving. Worth a lot. Don't sell your gun, Curly. Give you $18 for it. Sold. That makes it fit. $53, Ann Ellen. Anybody going any higher? Going, going, down. Well, what's the matter with you folks? Ain't anybody going to cheer or nothing?
by yourself. Not a minute more than you had to. Well, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm with you by myself now, ain't I? You wouldn't have been if you could have got out of it. Mornings, you stay in your room all the time. Nights, you sit in the front room, won't get out of any other side. Last time I seen you alone, it was winter. The snow was six inches deep in drifts. Me sick. You bring that hot soup out to me. Me in bed. I hadn't shaved in two days. You asked me if I had any fever. You touched your hand on my head to see. I, I remember. Do you? Bet you don't remember as much as me. I remember everything you've ever done. Every word you ever said. Can't think of nothing else. See? See how it is? Ain't good enough, am I? I'm a hard hand. Got dirt on my hands. Pigs love. Ain't fit to touch you. You're better. So much better. Yeah, we'll see who's better. Miss Lori. Then you wish you wasn't so free with the airs. You're such a fool, lady. Air, you making threats at me? Air, you standing there trying to tell me about it and allowing me to slobber all over me like a hog while you're gonna do something about it? Why, you're nothing but a mangy dog and somebody ought to shoot you. You think so much about being a hot hand? Well, I'll just tell you something that'll rest your brain, Mr. Judd. You ain't a hot hand for me no more. You can just pick up your duds and scoop. Oh, and I got even better ideas than that. You ain't coming to the place again, you hear me? I'll send your stuff any place you say. But don't as much set a foot inside the past your gator, I'll set the dogs onto you. Said you say. Brought it on yourself. Can't help it. Can't never rest. <clears throat> Told you the way it was. You wouldn't listen.
first time I ever seen you. It was at the fair. You was right there. Brave Philly at Blue Stabs. And I said to someone, well, who's that skinny little thing with that bang on her forehead? Yeah, well, I remember. You were riding Bronx that day. That's right. And one of them threw you. That... <laughs> you did not throw me. Guess you jumped off. I'm sure I jumped off. <laughs> yeah, you sure did. If there's anybody in this yard that can hear my voice, I want to know that Lori Williams is my girl. Curly! And she wouldn't have got her to ask her to marry me. They'll hear you all the way to Katusi. Let him. Just once in a while, give me one of them hard-hitting advice. 
Where's your back? Well, that ain't nothing. Bad to Oklahoma. Hello. <laughs>
hurry up now to dress. We gotta get going with it. You hurry and take your own ducks. They're laying all over my room. Hey, Will, will you fix that team to serve for me? Sure will. Have it up in the gym. Oh, I need 